Our real estate market right now is crazy, insane, right? If you're dealing with it, you know exactly what I'm talking about. But how does it translate to either buying a home, maybe you're putting your home on the market? Well, we've got some answers for you in this week's Real Estate Rundown. What's up everybody, Fernando Petty here with the UVO Real Estate Rundown, your source for all things real estate here on Fox. Today I'm joined with two of our top producing real estate agents, Jennifer Langford and Alan Kantarevich. Alan, share with us a little bit about what we're looking at when it comes to the prices. I mean, homes have appreciated an insane amount in the last year. Can you give us some numbers and, and, and kind of give us a comparison of what we're looking at right now? Sure, I would love to, Fernando. And you are absolutely right. You know, Utah, we are currently in a red hot burning market. Prices here have been going up pretty much by the day. It's pretty insane. For example, last year, the average priced home in Salt Lake County was $400,000. Fast forward a year later, the average priced home now in Salt Lake County is $468,000. In addition to that is the average priced home currently in Utah County is $450,000. Davis County is currently at $430,000. Tooele County is up to $360,000. And Weber County, which is up an astonishing 23% with an average priced home of $340,000. Oh my God, so that's good for sellers. Oh, it's fantastic. Yeah, it's great for sellers, but how are the buyers doing? <laughs> Jen, talk to me about how you're getting your clients under contract in today's real estate market. Right, so there are two important key factors that I use when you know, purchasing a home. And one is setting expectations with my clients on what is important in this market today and how to win and write offers. Secondly, communicate clearly with the seller, the seller's agent, and how we can win that offer. How committed are you to that property? Sellers actually see those things. No, you're right. You definitely have to have effective communication. You definitely have to have a buyer who's completely committed to the property. You don't want to be wasting anybody's time right now, especially in today's market. Thank you so much, Alan, for the real estate market update. Thank you so much, Jen sharing some of the, the tips and tricks that you use to help get properties under contract. Guys, stay tuned next week for more tips, more market updates here on the UVO Real Estate Rundown.